Alien Warners is an American serial killer nicknamed the Angel of Death. Police were only able to catch uh, her when the death toll reached seven. Uh, suicide was amazed at the number and uh, brutality of the crimes, but after the biography of the woman was made public, many felt sorry for her. Eileen Carol Peterman was born on February 29, 1956 in Rochester, Michigan. At the time born, uh, uh, her parents were minors and had early separated, so the girl never saw her father. Two months before she was born, Leo Dale Pittman was uh, convicted of pedophilia. In prison, Ellen's father was uh, diagnosed uh, with a mental disorder that drove him to suicide in 1969, and man uh, hung himself in his cell. At 14, Ellen became pregnant by an adult family friend and gave birth to a son, who had to be placed in foster care. The birth of a child and partying with him broke her completely. The girl dropped out of school. Soon my grandmother died and grandfather kicked her granddaughter out of the house. Ellen had uh, no choice uh, but to live in the woods and work as a prostitute on the highway. By the age of 13, she was more than 10 arrests for disorderly conduct. Uh, Warnows was uh, lately uh, reportedly tried for uh, fruit and uh, theft, including uh, weapons. Prostitution to she did not leave, it uh, gave money to life and uh, constant travel around uh, the country. Ellen felt uh, monstrous at the same time, which confirms uh, the suicide attempt at uh, 22 years. Ellen's first victim was one of the clients, Richard Mallory. The 51 years old man filmed a prostitute on the highway and then did not uh, return home. The uh, search began after three days. An uh, abandoned uh, car was found uh, near Ormond Beach and Richard's body was found a few miles uh, away. The cause of uh, death was several bullet uh, wounds to the chest. One of subsequent murders followed much the same pattern. Her victim were always middle-aged men whose car she stopped on the highway with a request for a ride to the uh, nearest city. One of dealt with everyone in the same way she shot at point black range with a pistol, took the body to the first to a landfill or other deserted place and they threw it with the car, always talking valuables from bags and pockets. Evidence the serial killer was trying to hide, not always. Apparently, a retaliation, she wasn't afraid or didn't think about it. The media called Warno the first uh, female maniac in the United States, but the title still belongs to the Lavinia Fuchsia. Executed in 1820, and Aileen became the second. Books uh, were written, uh, written about her life, uh, documentaries, uh, and uh, Future films were made. In uh, 2003, released uh, the film Monster. 
with Charlie's uh, throne in the main role. The creators uh, clearly fell for it, so Warner's uh, showing uh, the her as a woman with a hard fate, uh, commenting uh, Modest out of uh, revenge and self uh, defense. The story of the famous maniac is shown in the series American Horror Story, where the role of Ellen was uh, played by Lily Rape. 26 The Girl All of a Sudden Got Married. Her chosen Lewis uh, Gretz fell was uh, 49 years old, but he could uh, not control she, the uh, furious temper of the young wife. After two months, uh, the co couple uh, divorced. At the trial, the husband uh, complained uh, that all this uh, time Ellen was uh, wasting money and uh, beating him and uh, achieved that the former wife uh, was uh, forbidden to approach him. In 1996, the U.S. Supreme Court sentenced a serial killer to death. The sentence was uh, carried out only in 2002. Psychotherapists uh, recognized was uh, absolutely sane and uh, mentally healthy. She herself confirmed in an uh, interview uh, that she did not commit the murder in a state of uh, passion. Elaine knew what uh, she was doing and uh, it was a burning uh, hate of the victims that drew her not uh, fear. At the train, uh, the maniac said that she did not uh, regret uh, anything and uh, if uh, she started uh, life again, she would try to kill uh, those uh, men again. Instead of being electrocuted, uh, one of uh, received uh, a lethal indiction. Her last words before her execution were I'll be back. Ellen's uh, body was uh, cremated. Down uh, a boxing a childhood friend asked uh, permission to take the remains. She took uh, the uh, home to Michigan and uh, there. Uh, scattered the ashes to the wind. And so the life of the angel of death ended.